Hello everyone, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your daily tarot reading. It will be for Friday the 16th of April 2021 for all signs. So as always, it may or may not resonate with you. You decide what resonates. Okay, let's pull the cards and see what we get. So I'm using the Angel Answer cards. What do we have, please? Angel Spirits Guides message for the day. Friday the 16th of April 2021. What do people need to hear the most? I've got be assertive and ask your angels. That could be for help, advice, guidance, but there's definitely an energy of there is a reason to act, to be assertive, to assert yourself, go for something. Okay. So... Let's pull some cards and see what this is all about. What do we have, please, for Friday the 16th of April 2021? Friday the 16th of April 2021, please. Thank you. Nine of Pentacles. King of Pentacles. Virgo Energy, the Hermit. Nine of Wands, Two of Swords, uh, Seven of Cups, bottom of the deck we have the Empress. I'm going to get another card for this hermit let's clarify this hermit please can we clarify this hermit energy please okay I've got the eight oh, the eight of wands An energy here of uh, the six, uh, sorry, the seven, the nine of the, that. Honestly, the nine of wands. My mind went weird then. Uh, the nine of wands is one wand away from getting a goal, getting completion, finishing this difficult journey. So it's almost kind of like sometimes there's one thing to go before, and we've got the nine of pentacles, which is to do with material success, uh, feeling empowered. It's a card of empowerment. Uh, somebody who, using their practical skills, knowledge, experience, and focusing all that, has delivered material success. It's a card of abundance, self-sustaining energy, somebody who can really provide for themselves financially, take care of themselves, nurture themselves. They know their worth. You know, they know their worth with the Nine of Pentacles and they feel pretty good about it. So it feels, I'm feeling in this situation, something's, there's something going, it feels like there's something going on here. Um, you're one, you're one step away. So there is a card of being assertive. There is a, there is a resonance of being assertive to go for something because it feels like the success is within your grasp and that's definitely what I'm feeling the king of pentacles represents stability security safety you know he is just a stable energy you know now can sometimes represent an investor um, for those of you who might might be looking for investment uh, somebody offering you something as well the king can offer you something but the Two of Swords, it feels like somebody hasn't quite, they're, they're feeling stuck or they don't have the full information to make some kind of decision or maybe they're just weighing something up. It feels like you're one, you're one step away or one hurdle away from getting to 
what this nine of pentacles represents and I'm definitely getting this king of pentacles it could be somebody in business or a leader who is still weighing up their options here let's clarify this king of pentacles I feel they're weighing up things they're just weighing something up it doesn't feel like they've made a decision yet yeah news information um the knight of swords is also a clarity in which way to go how to progress but i'm definitely getting in this energy it feels like you're waiting on news from somebody it feels like you're waiting on news from somebody news information clarity feedback it definitely feels for some somebody has i'm definitely getting in this energy with the nine of wands yeah there, there's just it's almost kind of like there's one hurdle to go one thing to go and then we've got some information or some news coming in but there's no clarity on it yet you haven't uh, you haven't heard back or they, they aren't clear in, in how they're going to feed back or move forward. But, you know, it definitely feels in this energy. The, the Hermit is about finding answers from within. And the Eight of, the eight of Wands is definitely about forward movement. Uh, progress can also be to do with communication, news, information coming your way. It feels somebody's making some judgment call here. I'm getting an energy of somebody making some judgment call here, which brings some progress. It could be in the form of news, information, uh, a conversation. It might well be they might want another conversation with you. Let's get another card here. Yeah, I'm getting this feeling they, they want they want to get some clarity, and yeah, they do. I've got the King of Pentacles again. Uh, this King wants the clarity, male or female energy. It's generally Taurus for me as a reader, but they want clarity, or they, they want to get clarity. It feels that there are options here. There are there are multiple routes that they could choose. You know, if you're competing for a, a job or a, or a Whatever is going to bring you greater material success into your life, job, business, new business, sales, contract, call it what you will. Um, it, I'm definitely getting this energy that they're, to move forward, they're wanting some kind of clarity. So they might well have another conversation with you, which will make up their mind. And I like the Seven of Cups because it, it's a promise energy. It's a promising sign. Um, you're still in the game. You're still in the game, is what I'm getting. To celebrate, yay! <laughs> so I've got reasons to celebrate here. Yeah, it feels like there's a promising sign where this person hasn't quite made up their mind, so they want another conversation with you. So they're coming back to you. The feedback is the f they're coming back with a conversation. Uh, to want a conversation and again you know mercurial energy you know the mercury in cancer there is definite reasons to celebrate this is reaping the harvest energy you know very much and um, you know that the empress is the birth of something new very good in terms of new in terms of money areas very good in terms of love but it feels in this situation i'm getting more money i have to say um, it, it feels like somebody hadn't quite made up their mind, so they're coming back, they want another conversation with you, so that they can really find the right answer, you know, that they can get the clarity that they need in, in which person they're going to go for. It feels like maybe you've been competing for something. The message is somebody's going to come back and ask you for another conversation here, but I'm definitely getting in this energy. It's going to end in celebration, success. You know, reasons to celebrate here. The winter is over, the spring is here. And the Empress is abundance, new abundance coming into your life. 
I'm definitely getting this. It feels very, very good in terms of the money areas because the Nine of Pentacles can, it can mean other things, but a lot of the time with the cards on the table, it feels to do more to do with money, career, finances. So somebody wants another conversation with you. Don't worry, be assertive absolutely embrace it and do the work by the way but there's definitely an energy of you know because this person is all knowing in terms of the practical aspects the detail as well so make sure you're on the ball with the detail but i'm definitely getting in this energy that you know uh, there's new new income in abundance coming your way um the birth of something new which feels very good in terms of money career finances okay interesting reading <laughs> Wasn't sure where it was going for a while, but we got there. <laughs> okay, so moderation. Is there something you know you shouldn't be eating? Try to eat mindfully and healthily. Although the fairies say a little bit of what you fancy is fine. Interesting energy. <laughs> Might be a message for somebody. We've got moon energy, surrender to the natural ebb and flow of life. If you're feeling confused, this fairy comes to calm emotions and reassure you that peace of mind is possible. Really like the energy there. It feels, I feel somebody is getting um, peace of mind. There is a bit of confusion. It feels like somebody is confused, which is probably making you confused. And I'm definitely getting some kind of leader in business or head in business. And they haven't made up their mind up there, weighing up their options. It feels like you're in the game along with other people because they've got their options open here. But there's definitely an energy of they want another conversation with you in order to make the mind up, in order to find their answer that they need. And there's definitely an energy of new abundance coming your way as a result. Yeah, lovely energy. So I hope you enjoyed the reading. If you do, please do like, share and subscribe. I hope it's a wonderful day for you all and I will see you next time. Thank you.